DJ Raw based on the ones and twos. Good morning, Raw Dolls and Raw Bros. How y'all doing today? Hey, you're dirty. Hopefully, everything's good. This is your boy, DJ Raw Bizzetti. It's DJ Raw Bass. To all my girls, you're raw dolls. To all my bros, you're raw bros. Did I say that right? Raw dolls and raw bros? Uh. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're the raw dolls and raw bros because you're part of the Raw Bass family. I want to thank y'all for tuning in to my vlog or another vlog or another vlog uh, whatever 12 seconds later so you're probably wondering what we got going on today today we are going to see some special needs baseball yeah we're definitely going to go support that so all the raw dolls and all the raw bros we are going to be on the baseball field and we're going to be supporting special needs baseball so the person that is coordinating this whole thing, her name is Christine Ross. She's a real good friend of mine and she is actually coordinating this whole movement because this isn't just one game. This isn't just two games. This is like a small little season that she's doing. So we're definitely going to go see Christine Ross out there on the baseball field. On top of, we're going to talk to her and find out what's going on with the special needs baseball on top of why does she do this i want to know don't you want to know yeah, yeah. so right now i need y'all to comment below in the comment section to let christine ross know that this is an excellent idea and the raw dolls and raw bros we have your back to support you and everything that you're going to be doing for the special needs baseball i think it's an outstanding idea a few moments later you know what it's getting a little hot you know like I, I think i need a change so i'm gonna just go ahead and change right now all right raw dolls and raw bros that was quick right Damn! nah i'm just playing you know it took like 30 minutes you know when the camera trick you know you gotta do the camera trick but like I said, we are going to go see Christine Ross and the project that she's got going on. Actually, it's a movement because she wants to continue this like years and years, years down the line. And of course, us from the Raw Base family, we are definitely going to support her every year that she does this. So let's go ahead and make it positive, baby. You know how we do it. But. This scene is like, it's really, really still hot in here. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to try this teleportation thing. So we're going to try to teleport to the baseball field. Won't we do that? All right. Y'all uh, get ready to take this ride with me because it's going to be a journey. Okay. And we're here. Actually, uh, no, we're not raw dolls and raw bros. We are actually... <laughs> in a park yeah uh let's try this again because this is definitely the wrong place this is not the baseball field so we're gonna try this again y'all hold on now we are here actually we are not we are in a grocery store how did we get here i don't think we're supposed to be here um Maybe I'll get some apples or something like that before I leave, or some bananas. Uh, who knows? We're going to try this again, Raw Dolls and Raw Bros, because we're actually in a grocery store. So, y'all hold on. All right, Raw Dolls and Raw Bros, we're finally here. No, we're not, actually. We are in the Christmas section of Lowe's. This is pretty crazy. Uh, I have no clue how we got here. But it's close to Christmas, so make sure you do your Christmas shopping. You gotta do your Christmas shopping, because that's what the Raw Dolls and Raw Bros do. But, like I said, we're in Lowe's. 
Um, should we look around? No, we're trying to get to this special needs baseball game. Y'all hold on. Whoa, raw dogs and raw dog. Uh. Raw bros, we finally made it. We finally made it. Yeah, actually we did. We are actually here at the baseball field, finally. Like I said, we've transported from many places and in the transportation or teleportation, however you want to call it, uh, guess who uh, came? Uh, we picked up A-Rock. I don't know how we picked him up, but some some reason he's out here with us and definitely, definitely we are looking forward to this special needs baseball game. We're definitely going to find Christine. Hopefully y'all keep on staying tuned to this vlog because it is so awesome and so moving. Hey, Rock's sitting right over there. He's doing his vlog as I'm doing mine. So we're definitely going to find Christine and see if we can interview her. I'm so excited. How about you? Like really, really? Like are y'all really excited of what's going on today? If you're excited, don't not only subscribe right now comment below in the comment section and let me know that you're excited because i'm telling you this is so moving we just seen a little guy that actually helps with the champion special needs league he was saying that his mom didn't even like ask him he wanted to volunteer which is so so moving so moving so like i said I don't know where Christine is at, but we're definitely going to find her. And like I said, we're just going to give a quick interview because we, we just want to ask some questions. No, we want to know some things. We'll keep on looking. Like I said, I don't know. She's somewhere around here, but we'll find her. We'll definitely find her because that's what the raw dolls and raw bros do. We find, we search until we succeed. So I'll be with y'all in a minute whenever we find Christine. Meanwhile, all right, raw dolls and raw bros, we're here at the Great Neck League Fields, and we actually got some fans right here. Stuff like that. Like I said, like I said, they're huge, huge fans, huge subscribers. They're out here supporting the movement. You know, it's a good vibe out here. It's a very good vibe and stuff like that. Like I said, what we're doing here is not only supporting the special needs league baseball, but y'all have a fall fest out here, correct? Yes. Yeah, so there are numerous baseball games, numerous softball games and stuff like that for fall fest here in Virginia Beach. So like I said, we're definitely, definitely loving the vibe that's out here. Like I said, we, we have some fans out here that follow the page, they follow the Instagram, they follow the YouTube channel. So it's so good for this movement to actually take place. So y'all keep on, keep on subscribing, share the videos, do everything that you can in order to make this movement even bigger. Two thousand years later. All right, raw dolls and raw bros, guess who we found? And I just like spotted her, been looking all over for her and we finally, finally see her. She is right over here. She's actually doing some work. But that is Christine Ross right here. Like I said, we're going to walk over here and we're definitely, definitely going to interview Christine Ross. So like I said, y'all stay tuned for this one because we're going to try to be serious, you know, you know how raw, raw base is. He's always trying to be funny and stuff like that, but we got to make this one pretty serious. But it's hard because Christine's a funny person too. So a few moments later so raw dolls and raw bros we finally are here with christine ross here she is right here what's up guys i, I know y'all wanted to know why she does what she does so we are going to ask the big question that the raw base family wants to know christine what drove you to create this league for everybody that has a special needs child sure well my son is um has autism. He's nonverbal autistic. And I just really wanted a place where he could come and be himself and play and have a good time. And a lot of people don't know this, but my son Aiden actually played for this on this field. And so did my brother. So I actually grew up on this field. You know, my brother's been playing since he was five years old. So I was about nine or ten. And my parents would drag me to this field. So I've literally been coming to this field for 20 years. That's why it was super important that we try to get the special needs team on this particular field. Like we could have went anywhere. You know what I mean? But Grey Neck just means so much to me because I've, you know, I've spent, like I said, 20 years of my life here. 
okay. Everybody's okay, just so okay. nice and friendly. And anyway, so this particular field is why I wanted to do it. But, you know, I just wanted Ethan and Ethan enjoy the same things that every other kid enjoys. That's awesome. That's so awesome. All right, now, with the league that you're doing, are you looking to expand in for the next season? Yes, we actually just got approved, so we will be back in the spring, which is awesome. Um, Registration is probably going to start around February, March, so I would say just check within Great Next Facebook and their website, my Facebook. I'm going to be sharing it as soon as we can register. And because it got picked up for the spring, I'm pretty sure this is a permanent thing now. This is, we're here to stay. We're not going. This nice. is it. Yes, nice. We're excited. Very nice. Very nice. Now, Raw Dolls and Raw Bros, I want y'all to meet a special, special kid. His name is Andrew, and he definitely has a story for you. So I'm going to turn the camera over to him so y'all can hear his story, and hopefully, hopefully you still tune in. And like I said, get in the comment section. I need y'all to comment that this is an outstanding idea for the Special Needs Baseball League that Christine has formed. So right now, I'm going to ask Andrew right here. What made you become a volunteer for this league? Well, it made me be a volunteer because a kid, was, a kid in my class was bullying a special needs kid. So I walked over to him and said, stop bullying him. He said, why? I said, because he's special needs. You don't do that to him. And he's like, okay, but I still want to do it. I said, no, if you do it again, I'll tell the teacher. And he's like, fine, I won't. And so I became a volunteer since that happened. Wow, that's awesome, man. That's, that's awesome. He's here every Saturday. He plays baseball here too, and he takes his day out when he could be doing anything else, playing with his friends, playing video games to yeah. come and help other kids, which is amazing. That is that is simply amazing. Simply amazing. As we were asking questions, maybe I was asking you a couple questions the other day, and you were saying that this league is going to become more like a non-profit well great neck is a non-profit with baseball but i'm starting my own non-profit now so my non-profit is called aid another and um, aid another basically is just empowering special needs kids and families just bringing them part of the community you know and our whole philosophy and motto is what your kid could do our kid could do you know so that's where we're going to be starting so right now it's pending we have our llc we have our website it's www.aidanother.com but we're still working on paperwork right now so we're super excited about it. And then with eight and other will come other activities besides baseball for the special needs community. That's awesome. That's so awesome. All right, Raw Dolls and Raw Bros. We're actually out here on the field right now. And <laughs> what's going on, man? Good. How you doing? Good. Good. You doing good? You going to take a picture? Yeah. They're about to start their game here probably in about five minutes. So we're definitely going to get good footage of the game and what goes on with this league like i say it's so special of what they're doing it's so amazing i cannot get enough of the vibe from the parents from the children that are actually helping from christine coordinating all this this is what i'm talking about raw dolls and raw bros becoming that miracle you know you have to search for that miracle and the miracle is within everybody that's out here today. So continue, continue blessing people, continue showing love, continue doing what you do in order to make a difference because that is exactly what this league is about, is making a difference. It's so positive. So like I said, we're gonna get to this game because I'm excited about the game. Are you excited about the game? Because the Raw Base family is always excited.
Raw Dolls and Raw Bros. What do y'all think of that? That was an outstanding game. It was so, so amazing how everybody just got together and did their thing. You know, I had a good time. Did you have a good time? Tell me you had an awesome time because this was very, very exciting. I'm glad I came out here. I got to meet some of the parents, some of the kids, some of the volunteers, which is so amazing. And like I said, I'm glad that we teleported and A-Rock came into the scene. A-Rock is somewhere around here. I don't know where he went. But like I said, so, so, so much fun. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to my channel. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Once again, Raw Dolls, Raw Bros, I hopefully y'all had a good time. And like I always say, don't search for the miracle, be the miracle. And I'll see y'all later.